Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be all about my bridesmaid proposals. I think this is going to be my very first wedding content video on my channel. So if you did not know, I am. I recently got engaged like how many weeks ago? Four weeks ago? Three weeks ago? Um, on New Year's Eve in Mexico. And it was just everything I could have imagined and more. Um... It's crazy because, you know, nothing really prepares you for that moment. Um, it was just really special. And I'm just super excited to be getting married to the love of my life. So, um, I don't know if you guys know this, but I've always wanted to be a wedding planner. I have always loved weddings. And I'm just super excited that I'm finally, um, you know, planning my own wedding. And it's been really fun so far um and it's like i'm taking it all in every moment every step um and i'm just really excited to be a bride um so i definitely want to take you guys along my bridal journey um and you know looking for a venue and a dress and all of that um but part of that means you know asking my bridesmaids to be my bridesmaids, taking them with me, asking for their opinion, um, taking them dress fitting, taking them to dress fittings, um, having their help picking out a venue and everything like that. So it was really important for me to ask my girls first um, and make it really special for them. Um, so I am going to have seven bridesmaids, um, including my maid of honor. So there's going to be seven girls in total. Four of them live in the area and then three of them live out of state. For my out of state girls, I'm just going to be sending them their box uh, through mail. I wish they were here, but unfortunately, obviously they're not. But for my girls that are in the area, I'm actually going to have a little dinner for them. I want to make it really special and really fun. Um, and then I'm going to give them their boxes at the dinner. But I kind of wanted to show you guys what I'm doing for my bridesmaids. Um... Kind of give you guys some ideas and i hope you guys enjoy this video i've been watching so many of these videos the past several weeks and i think they're just really fun so i'm excited to make them um i love my boxes honestly i'm like obsessed with them um so i hope you guys like them i hope you guys get um some ideas some inspiration and yeah i'm just really excited so so if you guys want to know how i made my bridesmaid boxes what i put in them or what i ordered then keep on watching the first thing that I purchased was actually literally the day after I got engaged. I knew right away that I wanted to give them really beautiful boxes um, and just kind of splurge on them a little bit more. Boxes. I actually found them on Etsy um, and I was really, really happy that I found them. So they are wooden boxes. They look like this. The quality is so good. Um, I knew I wanted something either wooden or glass. Well, not glass, but like clear. I didn't want to go with just the regular cardboard box. Um, and when I saw these, I fell in love. It had really good reviews. I will leave the link for um, for the Etsy store down below. And I love how they engraved each of my bridesmaids' uh, boxes. So this one is going to be for my sister. Her name is Carla. And I just felt like it was super cute. And it's definitely a box that they could continue to use even after um, I give it to them. So it's a great storage box. I think it's super pretty. And I absolutely love these boxes. The box opens up like this. I love that it comes with some tissue paper already and a sticker. I did think about taking off this sticker and putting in like a different sticker. But... It ripped my other um, the tissue paper ripped a little bit so I'm just gonna leave it, it doesn't bother me too much um, so yeah so once you open it it does come with this fringe what is this called this fringe material interested in looking them up I will leave them down below on Etsy it comes with this gold little leaf which I'm not using and it also comes with this ribbon which is actually really pretty i did think about using it but i actually found some other um ribbon that i will show you guys that i did like a little bit more but again if you do decide to use these boxes you can always use what it comes with this now to go inside i really wanted 
to do obviously some beauty items. So the first one that I got was the Mario Badescu spray water. I have been using this for years and years and years. It just smells so good and I feel like any girl would like it. Um, so yeah, I went ahead and I purchased that. The second item I purchased was from Francesca's and it's like a lip mask. And I personally just like the cup, the color of it. I like how it was like also like this mauvey pink color. Um, so I was like, oh, that's cute. You usually do, you know, under eye patches or like a sheet mask or something. So I thought this was different and it's cute. And it also goes with the next item that I purchased. Um, I love the Summer Fridays lip butter lip butter balm i absolutely love it um i use it all the time and i'm obsessed with it so when i was thinking about what to get my girls i knew i wanted to get each one of them this lip butter because they will all love it it's clear um and i know they're gonna love it so i did get the hydrating lip uh the hydrating lip gels to go with their summer fridays lip balm i just thought perfect combo so this was more of a little splurge for them um but i know they're gonna love it and i'm just so excited okay the next item i got for them i really wanted to give them a cheesy little quote i didn't know exactly what item i wanted to give them um i didn't know if i wanted to do a cup a candle but um yeah i couldn't really figure out but then I came, I saw on Etsy there was a lot of little scrunchies that had the phrase, I can't tie the knot without you. I tried to order some on Etsy, but they were going to get here in like another two weeks. Um, so I was like, oh, I'm not convinced. So I was just trying to figure it out. I went to Target and I found literally the perfect colors to go with my box. It's like this cream little uh, scrunchie with this pink one. And I was like, whoa, that matches so perfectly. So I purchased these on target they came in a set of two i purchased seven of them and then i just went to michael's and i got a little tag and the tag says i can't tie the knot without you so i thought it was cute i mean everyone loves the hair ties so i also am adding that to their boxes um and the last item i got for them was a personalized necklace with the initial of their name so i am creating my sister's box right now and I got her a K for Carla. Um, and I think it's just a really nice personal touch. I think everyone needs a dainty little initial necklace. So I really wanted to get that for each one of my girls. And again, I did get these at Francesca. And um, I like that they're 14K gold plated. So I know they're going to last a little bit longer. And um, I know they'll all love it. So each one of them has an initial necklace as well. That's pretty much all I got for their box. Let me show it to you guys. Kind of looks like that. I'm also going to give them a heart, um, or I'm going to make them uh, the breakable hearts um, that are made out of chocolate. And inside, I'm going to add some pictures that I have with each girl. So I printed out a whole bunch of pictures that we have together from when we were younger or anything like that. Just like take them down memory lane and be like, you know, we've we've been together for so many things and you mean so much to me. So let's look at some pictures that we have together. So and inside of the heart, I'm going to insert the pictures inside. So when they break it, they'll see like our pictures and memories. Next thing I got for them, I wanted to give them a card that obviously asked them to be my bridesmaid. Um, something that I could write inside, put a personalized message for each girl. I was looking everywhere for cards and I couldn't really find any that I loved. I did purchase some on Etsy but I wasn't convinced by them. I kept searching and looking and I looked into creating my own cards. I really wanted something just modern and dainty and just simple, minimalistic but like beautiful that would go with the box um, and like kind of like my style for, for my uh, wedding. So I finally came across some cards that I am honestly so obsessed with. Some people might not like these, but I am absolutely in love with them. I think it's like totally me and totally the aesthetic that I was looking for. And I'm just so excited about these cards. 
actually just got them in the mail yesterday because again I did order another pair of cards but I didn't love them and when they actually came in the mail I was really happy that I um, I had bought these so these are I know it's not gonna be for everyone but these are my new bridesmaid cards um, I don't know if the camera is getting it so it's just a plain white card but the material is really good it's like a, a sturdy card cardboard letter and then it's just pressed in and it says bridesmaid on it so I just thought it was so beautiful so clean so dainty so modern and just definitely what I was looking for again I know that this is not gonna be for everyone but I just think they're just so clean and fresh um, so on top of the box I got some material from Amazon that I'm obsessed with it kind of reminds me of Muslim cloth um, really beautiful ribbon I was looking for something that I kind of wanted at my wedding kind of like my wedding aesthetic um, so when I found these I was like well these are literally so perfect so I plan on doing is tying it around the box tying in the front and topping it off with these little bouquets that I made that I'm very proud of. They look like this. Are you kidding? They are so cute. So they're gonna go on top of the box like this, tied around with that ribbon. So really obsessed with my boxes. I think all my girls are gonna love them. Is definitely my aesthetic, my vibe, and I'm just super excited about them. I think they're just so beautiful. Um, so yeah, I hope you guys liked everything that I got for my bridesmaids for their boxes Now I'm gonna show you guys how I am gonna assemble everything in the next clip watching this video I hope you guys got inspired I hope you guys liked what I put together for my girls I think they're all gonna love it as you can see they were all super excited about it the dinner went great everything went great um, so thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope you guys are excited about these wedding series as much as I am and if you want me to you know help you with your wedding let me know because I'm living my dream right now so Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe and keep coming back for more wedding content. So I'll see you guys soon. Bye.